Hello students, welcome to West Bengal English Medium Guide. Today I am going to provide you the exercise and inside question answers from chapter 1, class 6, History, CBSC Board, uh, the first chapter, studying the past. So, don't forget to like the video, subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to get further notifications from the channel on the right hand. If you have any queries, then please let me know in the comment box and if you have missed any video, then please check out the description box or playlist. You will find all the videos from there. So let's start. The first chapter from class 6, History, CBSC Board, Studying the Past. Number A, tick the correct answer. Number 1, History is generally divided into options are 2, 4, 3 and 5. Answer is 3 time periods. Number 2, Physical remains like options are books, pots, bones, both B and C. So answer is B pots and jewelry help archaeologists to know about the past number three the indus valley civilization is an example of options are prehistory protohistory continuous his, uh, story and last option is history so the answer is b protohistory next number four dates in history are expressed in two terms options are bce and ce bct and sct bce and bde last option dce bce so the answer is a bce and c number five the options are vindhya range satpura range himalayas aravali range answer is himalayas act as a natural barrier between india and central asia number six inscriptions monuments art effects and coins are example of options are archaeological literary oral uh, recent answer is a archaeological uh, sources b fill in the blanks Number 1, history is the study of the past. Number 2, CE stands for common era. Number 3, geography has played an important role in the history of India. Now, the question answer part. Number C, short answer. Number 1, why do we need to study the past? The study of the past is important to understand the present. Since history is a continuous story of the event leading to another the present cannot be understood without understanding the past to know and fully understand the world we live in we have to aware of its past number two how have the himalayas helped in shaping the history of india the himalaya mountains in the north act as a natural barrier between india and central asia the passes in this mountains have acted as routes of contact since ancient times people soldiers merchants trader travelers scholars and others have often crossed these passes and traveled from one place to another they have brought new ideas customs and habits that have made our culture richer Next, number C, how is the work of an archaeologist and a historian similar to that of a detective? The work of an archaeologist and a historian is similar to that of a detective just as a detective solves a mystery with the help of clues. Archaeologist and historian solve the mystery of the past with the help of historical clues. Next, number D, long answer. Number 1, why did people first settle near the river valleys? People first settle near the river valleys because the river provided sufficient water for all their needs. Next point, the land near the river was very fertile. People could grow crops easily. Last point, the river served as means of transport. Number two, what are inscriptions? How do they help us know about ancient India? Written records engraved on rocks, cave walls, metal pillars, walls of temples and palaces and on clay and copper tablets are called inscriptions. Very often 
kings got the important events in their reg uh, reign and their achievements inscribed so that people could read them in this way by reading inscriptions we know about ancient india number 3 how are coins valuable source of information about ancient india coins are an extremely valuable source of information they tell us about the reigning periods of kings the economy of kingdom the extent of a king's empire and about trade with other regions coins also throw light on the art and religion of earlier times number 4 write a short note on secular literature writings which are not religious are called secular literature this includes stories poems plays biographies of kings accounts of foreign travelers and books on politics and science the Arthashastra by Kautilya, the Indica by Megasthenes, the plays and poems of Kalidasa, the accounts of Phaeon and Hyvan Sang, and the Sangam literature are some examples of secular literature written during the ancient period. Number five. <coughs> sorry pottery is one of the most common finds on an excavation site why pottery is often found on excavation site because it's durable and can last for thousands of years it provides valuable insights into ancient cultures including their daily life rituals trade trade and technological advancements its abundance also reflects its widespread use in various uh, civilizations throughout history six why do you think rulers in ancient times recorded their victories on hard surfaces like rocks and pillars recording victories on durable surfaces like rocks and pillars served as a form of historical documentation ensuring that the achievements of rulers were preserved for future generations this inscriptions also served to commemorate and glorify the rulers reign showcasing their power and authority to their subjects and potential advers um, adversaries additionally such inscriptions may have been seen as a way to legitimize the rul rulers authority and assert their dominance over conquered territories so these are the exercise question answers from the chapter 1 class 6 history book cbsc board studying the past i will provide the inside question answers in the next video so follow my channel uh, don't forget to like the video subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to get further notifications from the channel on the right and if you have any queries then please let me know in the comment box and if you have missed any video then please check out the description box or playlist you will find all the videos from there to get the next video inside question answers from this chapter just press the bell icon okay Uh, so that's all for today see you soon with a new video till then take care and bye